moving in the tree for 48 Charm Minister Drive on the 9th of August 2023. So I'm just outside, you have a white door which has been painted. However, scuff marks are visible even towards the bottom, but there is no damage. Silver fittings. So the door open and closes fine with no concerns. White painted, you have a speckle towards the bottom and the door looks slightly patchy, but with no concerns. Ceiling is white, patchy paint with no stains, no leak marks. Good, patchy paint. You do have a few light cobwebs which are visible, um, but overall suitable condition. And then you have your access to your loft, which is painted with black scuff marks present. Light bulb is present and working. So I'm just going to tilt the camera and do behind the door. So you do have very faint small scuff marks towards the bottom above the beading. And you do have slight damage from obviously this is where the door handle hits the door. But just going up and down, showing the clean condition with no general wear and tear marks, no handprints, no furniture marks, clean condition. The door above the bedroom, the wall above the bedroom, which is clean. You have a white door with no damage, silver fittings. But you do have very small faint marks which are present, but there is no cause for concern. The wall between bedroom and living room, white, clean, no handprints, no furniture marks, clean above the living room door. Door to the living room, which is clean with no cause for concern. Slightly damaged towards the bottom, as you can see, paint is lifting. Silver fittings with no concern. The wall between the living room and bathroom, white, clean with no concerns, no damage above the door to the bathroom bathroom door is white slightly damaged here which has been painted over silver fittings clean with no concerns wall between bathroom and utility so this is again white however you do have visible small marks which are present so it's just towards the bottom side of the wall and above to the utility is clean. Door to the utility is clean with no concerns, no damage. Few scuff marks visible towards the bottom. And then just back where you enter, few visible scuff marks towards the bottom, slightly further up. And then when you look at the intercom phone, you have patchy paint towards the top. And then few scuff marks are present. No hand prints or marks around the light fitting. Patchy paint left of that, overall clean. You have a rug, which I think could do with an additional clean. And then underneath this, you have your laminate flooring. So you can sit, if I just pull the flooring all the way through. There you go. With no damage, laminate, no concerns. Just going to head into the utility area. So I've done the door and then behind the door with no damage, clean condition. You can see a couple of scuff marks above the coat hook. Ceiling is magnolia in colour and you do have a couple of speckles present in various places. Light bulb is working and present. You have magnolia painted brickwork with paint starting to crack. No visible plaster until you get to the bottom. So the bottom line you can see, you have a dehumidifier supplied, magnolia walls, paint has peeled off the right side of the windowsill. Windows are clean from the inside only. And above you can see cracking paint and your meters are kept in here with your CO2 alarm, which will all be tested and meter readings provided. Overall clean with no concerns, beige carpet, you can see footwear marks present. It's, it's all been hoovered. It's slightly tired looking now. And obviously that door, the, clip, the hooks hit each other. So I'm just gonna head on to the bathroom. Let's do this. First. So I've done the door on the outside. You have the door on the inside, which paint has peeled in two places towards the bottom. And you have one, two, three, four holes present with paint peeling from the lock. Silver lock. 
working fine. And then you have a tail rag, tail rag above. Ceiling is painted white with no mold, no cobwebs, no paint peeling, clean condition. Light bulb working and present. And then we have the walls. So I'm just gonna go up and down the walls showing you their current condition. They are white clean, however, just next to the light pulley, you do have a brown mark. And then right off the mirror, you've got a couple of speckles. Just gonna go up and down, showing you it's clean condition, with no handprints, no watermarks, no splashes, clean condition, no visible mold on the mirror, you on the walls, mirror, unit, rust present, however, empty and clean. And then you have your white toilet, clean toilet seat, no visible hair or dirt. Which is fine. Next to that you have your behind your boarding, which is clean with no water damage. You also get to see some tiles which are clean. Hand basin with a white sealant, however you can see the mould appearing from underneath this sealant. And it's starting to uplift on the left hand corner. You do have a gap from your tile and sealant. A couple of watermarks are present, but there's no hairs, no blockage. Left side, right side, both working fine. And then you have your tiles around your window, which are clean, with your windows clean. And the net curtain, I think it could do be with a place because you do have speckles of mould present. But the windows are clean. Just continue with the tiles. So there's no damage to the tiles. Um, the ground is quite patchy, so it's not pristine, it's not white. Um, obviously, it's starting to discolour in areas. You have a clean glass shower screen with no watermarks, tile looking sealant, and the bathtub is clean with a crack which has been covered up. And then your bath panel, which your board is bowing, as you can see. You've got a clip missing, which is there. And then above, just continue with the walls, clean condition, no mold, no paint peeling, white. Flooring is green lino. It could just do with a quick hoover, no hairs or dust, and it's starting to bow left of the hand basin. And then we're gonna head into the bedroom. So behind the door, it's white with no damage. However, just above eye level, you do have scuff marks present, but there's no cause for any concern with a silver fitting. Ceiling is white, clean. It's quite patchy towards the corner, um, but in acceptable condition, there's no visible cobwebs, there's no stains, it's just patchy paint. Light bulb present with lampshade present. And I'm just gonna go up and down the wall showing you the current condition. So you have a mirror attached securely to the wall, which is clean. And then your walls are white, clean, with no visible handprints, no furniture marks, no cause for concern, no damage. Just a right of the bed. You can see the wall's quite patchy. However, there's no cause for concern, no damage. Wooden bed, mattress with duvet not tested bed's clean and then just left of the bed it's clean the wall is just quite patchy and you have a unit bedside gray tired looking draw one draw two with the marks at the bottom and draw three they're all empty all open and close it's just starting to Get a bit tired from the top. And then in this corner, right of the window, see the brush marks. And then underneath the window, no visible mould, no paint peeling. And then you do have a couple of scuff marks underneath the sockets with paint cracking towards the top. And then above, it's clean. Above the window, it's clean. And the window itself, because the top one is open with no concerns. Frame is also clean with windowsill wiped down. I'm just going to show you the walls above. 
and you have two white curtains just longer than window length not tested however no odor above the freestanding wardrobe no marks no scuffs and you have a two-door wardrobe which has two white patches present and then the backboard is starting to bow but the unit is empty draw one empty draw two empty and draw three also empty with no concerns you have a red red wall which is clean with no damage no paint peeling you do have white marks on the side but there's no cause for concern and you have a photo and just the left side clean you have a chest of drawers which is tired looking from the top right side empty and clean left side empty and clean draw one draw two draw three and draw four all empty and ready for you to use you have a white a single wardrobe attached ukulele to the wall and then the white wall surrounding also clean with no concerns just for the light switches it's not handprint it's just patchy paint laminate flooring to match the hallway and run a carpet with no hairs no dust no dirt suitable satisfactory condition no damage Okay, so I'm going to head into it. I'm going to turn that light off. I'm going to turn that light's off already. That light's off. This light off. And head into the kitchen area. So you have a sliding white door with a couple of speckles of missing paint, but overall in good, clean condition white. And then behind the door, open, obviously, slides open well with no concerns. You do have a couple of handprints visible around the handle, but with no, no concerns. I'm just gonna pop this mop brush here. So you have your ceiling. You have your ceiling, which is white, clean, with no grease marks. And you have six light bulbs, which are all spotlights working and present. So you've got two, four, six. So I'm just going to go up and down the walls. So you can see it's quite patchy in paint and you can see old visible grease marks. But it blends in quite well with no cause for concern. Above the door to the living room. And then left, over in good condition. It's clean with no handprints and no furniture marks. The fridge freezer is currently open and all clean. And then left, you do have a couple of speckles left of the radiator and just slightly above the radiator above the radiator you do have another couple of small visible speckles and a couple of visible cobwebs are present above the wardrobe unit clean above the window clean and the single unit and then we get to the cooker which is clean with no concerns the wall and then left the wards also clean this is a brand new electrolyte elect electra cooker sorry brand new never been used you can see the rims are all silver all sparkling pristine brand new condition and you have your oven again all brand new never been used fantastic pristine condition Yeah, they're all warming up. You have white tiles with, t it is, it's meant to be white grout, but you can see it's starting to get tired looking. Um, and obviously behind the hand basin, you can see speckles of mold present. So there's no damage to the tiles. Um, it is an old white sealant present. You have gray units, 
which are all fully closing with no concerns. And the handles, that's hot, that's hot, that's hot. That, yeah, they're all heating up. All heating up really well. There's no strong cooking odor and no concerns. Worktop has all been wiped down. I can't see there's been any visible scuff marks or knife marks. Sink, left side, right side, all currently working. The sink is clean. Worktop, you see no pop burns, no damage. We've got a white mark here, which is left of the strip, but with no visible damage. And you have a hot point freestanding washing machine, drawer, tray clean, door also clean. You have got a couple of speckles of mould right in the rubber. Doors all clean. I've done the fridge freeze out. You can see there's no dents, apart from handprints which are present. And a couple of, oh, it's just been, so you can see where it's been cleaned because you're getting white residue. So it just needs an additional dry cloth on it. Flooring is lino black with no damage, no burn marks, and no cause for concern. Got a couple of white speckles from paint, but overall clean. Window, you've got a tractor fan which has been removed, but obviously the glass has been filled in. The clean from the inside only. And then we have your living room. So I'm just going to pop this brush back to the room. So keep the video going. I'm going to pull this rug. Pull this rug through. I don't think it's going to reflate. And then pull it through. This flooring's already been recorded, so I'm going to head into the living room. So I'm going to do behind the door. The door is white, clean, with no damage, silver fitting. Your ceiling is white, clean, with no stains, no leak marks, no paint peeling, clean condition. Light bulb is also working and present, and I'm just going to get a different angle of the ceiling. So you can see it's clean with no concerns. And I'm just gonna go up and down showing the condition of the walls. Walls are white, clean, with no handprints, no furniture marks, no concerns, picture present. Fireplace with no damage, no ring tea marks on cups, no marks, no dust, no dirt clean condition left you do have a couple of speckles on the walls here behind the tv unit and further up but overall in good satisfactory condition above the window it's clean and the window is clean from the inside showing you the walls around the window and then just underneath the window where the unit is, no marks or damage. And then you have a unit present with speckles of white paint. And behind it's clean and behind there it's also clean with no concerns. Left of the window where the walls are clean with no damage, no handprints. And then right of the sofa it's clean. And you can see there is a gap between the wall and the sofa. I don't know if that's just a shadow. No, you can see there's a sofa line on the wall. So you just need to make sure there's plenty of room between the wall and the sofa. But you can see underneath there's no marks and no other additional handprints and no additional furniture marks. Left of the sofa, it's clean with no concerns. And then continuing round, no concerns. I think it's just where I'm standing, it's quite... Yeah, you can see there's a patch on the wall, patchy paint present. And then the door 
above. So I've done the door already. I'm just going to close it so we can see the wall. So there's no concerns with the wall. It's clean with no damage apart from one scuff mark. So you can see it as patchy paint. And then last bit of the wall remaining. No handprints or concerns. Okay, you have a three-seater brown sofa, which is starting to look tired with visible marks. Not tested. I've done the unit. You have a TV stand, which is empty and clean. And then you have a, a yellow shaggy kind of rug, which has no stains and no visible marks with no odours. And then you have your, light, your laminate with no concerns. It's all been hoovered. It's all been mopped, there's no stickiness. I've seen walking around in several different places. My feet aren't sticking to it, clean condition. And then you have long two beige window length curtains. And I'm gonna try and do this smoke alarm it's quite high up now though. That's fine. Let's do the CO alarm first. Working. Okay, and then I'm going to head to the smoke alarm. And that's working as well. 